In 1978, one of only 48 copies of the Gutenberg Bible, the first large printed book, was sold to a library in Germany for over two million United States dollars, making history as the first book or manuscript to sell for over one million dollars. Today, however, that sale doesn't even make the top 20. Let's go and find out which are the most expensive books and manuscripts in history. Book of Mormon, 35 million United States dollars. In 2017, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints better known as the Mormon Church purchased a printer's manuscript of the Book of Mormon, the earliest surviving copy of the sacred text published by Mormon Church founder Joseph Smith in 1830, for 35 million United States dollars from the Community of Christ, another church based on the teachings of Joseph Smith. Letter from Zhang Gong to his friend, 31.73 million United States dollars. A 124-character letter written by 11th-century scholar, writer and government official Zhang Gong sold at auction in 2016 to Chinese movie mogul Wang Zongjun, a known collector of art and historical artifacts, for 207 million yuan 31.73 million United States dollars. The value of the letter nearly doubled since its last sale in 2009 for 109 million yuan. Codex Lester, 30.8 million United States dollars. Bill Gates, founder of Microsoft and once the wealthiest man on the planet, purchased Da Vinci's Codex Lester at auction for 30.8 million United States dollars in 1994, making it the most expensive book purchase to that date. In 2018, Gates digitized the pages of the Codex for a traveling exhibition, which allows people to browse the manuscript through a kiosk called the Codescope. Magna Carta, 21.32 million United States dollars. In 2007, one of only 17 known copies of the Magna Carta, the basis for democratic constitutions throughout history, was sold at auction for 21.3 million United States dollars. This particular copy was created in 1297, when Edward I enacted the Magna Carta as law, 82 years after King John signed the original document at the behest of rebel barons. Sherburn Missile, 21.21 million United States dollars. In 2001, the British government arranged a deal with the Duke of Northumberland to purchase the Sherburne Missile, a spectacularly illustrated manuscript dating from the early 15th century and considered a masterpiece of English art. To prevent the Duke from selling it abroad to cover £9.4 million in owed inheritance tax, the government waived the tax, while the Heritage Lottery Fund and the British Library sourced an additional £5.6 million for the manuscript, coming to a total of £15 million 21.21 million United States dollars. Crisis averted. New Book of Tang, 17.25 million United States dollars. Translated as, Pronunciation and Abstract of the New Book of Tang from Shibi Jingxi, this commissioned history of the Tang Dynasty, itself dating from the Song Dynasty, sold for a remarkable 110.4 million yuan, 17.25 million United States dollars at auction in 2018. Saint Cuthbert Gospel, 14.34 million United States dollars. The Saint Cuthbert Gospel is the oldest intact book in Europe. Buried with Saint Cuthbert in the late 7th century, it was found in the Saint's coffin over 400 years later at Durham Cathedral. Purchased by the British Library for £9 million 14.34 million United States dollars, in 2012, the gospel is now on display, both in person and online. Bay Psalm Book, 14.2 million United States dollars. In 2013, philanthropist David Rubenstein purchased one of 11 known copies of the Bay Psalm Book, the first known printed book in the United States, for 14.2 million United States dollars. Dating from 1640, where it was published in Cambridge, Massachusetts, this small book of psalms for Puritan churchgoers is the most expensive printed book in history. Rothschild Prayer Book, 13.6 million United States dollars. The Rothschild Prayer Book is an illustrated manuscript of prayers dating from the early 16th century and named after the wealthy Rothschild family, who owned the manuscript for several generations before it was confiscated by the Nazis in 1938. In 2014, Australian businessman Kerry Stokes purchased it at auction for 13.6 million United States dollars. Illustrated folio from the Shahnameh of Shah Thomas, 12.15 million United States dollars. The Shahnameh Book of Kings is an epic poem about the mythical history of the Persian Kingdom.
In 2011, the illustrated folio of a version of the Shahnameh commissioned by Shah Tomasp in the 16th century was sold for 7.4 million pounds, 12.15 million United States dollars, a record for a piece of Islamic art. Gospels of Henry the Lion, 11.8 million United States dollars. In 1983, an almost perfectly preserved manuscript of the Gospels dating from the 12th century, was purchased by the West German government and an assortment of private banks for 8.14 million pounds 11.8 million United States dollars, which was the most expensive work of art sold at auction at that point in time. The Birds of America, Hesketh copy, 11.5 million United States dollars. Only 119 copies of the Birds of America exist today, and it is a major event whenever a copy goes on auction. In 2010, Sotheby's sold a copy of the book, which was published in the mid-19th century and contains hundreds of hand-colored prints by James John Audubon, for 7.3 million pounds .5 million United States dollars. The copy had once been owned by Lord Frederick Hesketh, a British collector. Walt C. Muller Map, 10 million United States dollars. German cartographer Martin Waldseemuller's 1507 map of the world is notable for being the first such map to use the name, America, named for explorer Amerigo Vespucci, for the continents now known as North and South America. The map was purchased from the German government in 2001 by the Library of Congress for 10 million United States dollars. Mr. William Shakespeare's comedies, histories and tragedies, 9.97 million United States dollars. Commonly known as the First Folio, an original copy of the collected works of William Shakespeare from 1623 sold at auction to a private collector in 2020 for 9.97 million United States dollars. There are only six known, complete copies of the First Folio in the world, and this copy is now the most expensive work of printed literature ever sold at auction. Acts of Congress, 9.83 million United States dollars. In 2012, the Mount Vernon Ladies Association of the Union, a nonprofit that operates George Washington's Mount Vernon estate as a museum, purchased Washington's personal copy of the American Constitution and Bill of Rights for 9.83 million United States dollars, which was a record for any American historical document at the time. Babylonian Talmud, 9.32 million United States dollars. Daniel Bomberg first printed a complete edition of the Babylonian Talmud in 1520, and only 14 of those sets are still known to exist. In 2015, one of those copies was purchased at auction by Leon Black, a wealthy New York businessman, for US$9.3 million, United States dollars, making it the most expensive piece of Jewish literature ever purchased. Yongle Encyclopedia, US$9.21 million. United States dollars. The original Yongle Encyclopedia, commissioned in the early 15th century during the Ming Dynasty, consisted of 11,095 volumes, making it the largest general encyclopedia in history until Wikipedia came along. A mere two volumes, produced a century later for the Jiajing Emperor, sold for 8.13 million euros, 9.21 million United States dollars in 2020. The Olympic Manifesto, 8.8 million United States dollars. French aristocrat Pierre de Coubertin wrote the Olympic Manifesto in 1892, calling for a modern incarnation of the Olympic Games four years before the first modern games in Athens, Greece. In 2019, it was purchased at auction for US$8.8 million United States dollars by Russian billionaire Alisher Yuzmanov, and subsequently donated to the Olympic Museum in Lausanne, Switzerland. 15th century Quran manuscript, US$8.76 million United States dollars. In June 2020, a 15th-century manuscript of the Quran, the Islamic holy book, was sold at auction for £7 million The manuscript is notable because it was written on colorful gold-flecked Chinese paper, and the price almost doubled the previous record for a Quran sold at auction. United States Declaration of Independence, US$8.14 million only 25 copies of the first printing of the Declaration of Independence, sometimes known as the Dunlap Broadside, are known to exist, and one of them sold to a consortium of private buyers for US$8.14 million in 2000. Remarkably, this copy was discovered as the backing of a framed painting sold at a flea market in 1989. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe for more information. Please do support us.